Most people out there that follow me in my work are very aware of CERN and that CERN is a facility where they have been atom smashing and conducting all types of crazy tests for many years now. Now there is talk that they want to build a new grandiose facility that will dwarf the one they're working with now. But there is an experiment taking place in the United States, in Tennessee, that is similar in nature not using the Large Hadron Collider, but using different techniques and different stuff. What they're talking about doing here is revealing that there is a mirror world or universe that is attached to ours. This is similar to the talking we heard in the past couple of years from CERN, where CERN came out and stated they were trying to fold the next dimension of space-time into this one. It was something that they had on the drawing board. Then they came out and said that they discovered a blip that was an anomaly of data. It threw them off, and then we heard nothing else of that experiment. And that is huge, trying to fold another dimension into this one, tapping into the ether realm. In this instance, the scientists in Tennessee are saying what they've noticed is when they send, when they're sending this energy toward a wall, so to speak, you shouldn't detect anything on the other side. Now they're saying they believe that some of these particles are oscillating, oscillating into what they call a mirror world, and then back into this reality with a proton. They're trying to prove this. So, Interesting talk. They're also using magnetic fields on the other side of the wall, adjusting the strength to see if that will help them break through. So they're using, I'm sure, frequency, magnetism, and other technologies here in trying to conduct this test, but I wanted to let it be known. It's not just CERN out there that's trying to do crazy stuff like this. You have scientists all over the place trying to pop open portals to parallel universes. And in this instance, they're talking about a mirror world where the atoms are mirroring everything here in this world. And they're saying, if that's the case, it could potentially mirror life. Anyhow, this is some of the latest. I will leave a link below. Make sure to join us for Underground World News Live, 9 p.m. Eastern, every Friday night. And join us on DLive for exclusive calls afterwards. Links below.